Well, I was uh, raised in Southampton and uh, associated with the club from a young age. Um, I went off into a path not being good enough to be a pro soccer player of local amateur soccer and um, always followed the club very passionately. Um, sat with my father on his deathbed when he watched the cup final when we won in 1976. Followed them all in Europe when we first went there to the quarterfinals of the European Cup Winners Cup in, in 1977, which is uh, exciting. And uh, then the journey back through. And I came to this country in 1989. Southampton Football Club have always been extremely generous about supplying me with equipment and uh, promoting the Premier League and um, you know, giving me uniforms and stuff like that. So I reached out to them and said, hey, you know, it's nice that we get this, but you know, can we do something for the kids? And especially in San Juan Capistrano at Capo FC, who uh, do a fantastic job in a very, very affluent area of volunteering in a league where they support children and get them through college scholarships 90% of the time through their soccer ability, when they, these kids would have no opportunity. They come from single parents and from immigrant families and from impoverished circumstances, uh, overcrowded housing, you know, uh, you know, supported by, by government benefits and stuff in, in, in some cases. And so that was possibly, if not probably, the most rewarding to see the way they, they uh, develop from eight year olds right the way through to 18 year olds. And when they come back from college, 90% of the kids get a scholarship, they then play for the club's adult team which is really rewarding to see, and they're very good. My play in soccer has introduced me to the vastest and most diverse community that you could ever imagine. Uh, you know, right now I play with an Israeli, a Senegalese, I play with a Sierra Leone guy, a guy from Egypt, another one from France, and several from England, as well as a few of our compatriots from here in the States. So it's, uh, it's immense and it opens up opportunities in business. It helps you focus more at work when you're fit and you have a team-oriented uh, attitude towards life and approach.